For every start, there's a finish. For every beginning, there's an end. For every path, there's a past. And for Dr. Khalid, his start, beginning, and path lead back to his past. Khalid is about the spirit, the energy, the power, the mentality of knowing our history. And our history should not be a mystery. One of the other major challenges, we get invited to all white schools by white people who seem more concerned about the education and the historical value than our own people. Khalid grew up in a two-parent household in Detroit, Michigan. His father was a collector who took him to car shows and conventions. Eventually, Khalid became a collector himself. Unfortunately, his father would later take his own life, putting Khalid into a dark space that he had to fight his way out of. It's Khalid's energy, his spirit, and his dedication to making the past alive and making us link to our ancestors and making us understand that we are chosen people, so-called chosen frozen. He later worked in the entertainment industry where he managed and forged a friendship with Proof of D12. Proof would later be murdered, sending Khalid deeper into that dark space. After attending the Million Man March, Khalid was inspired to take his collection on the road in the form of a mobile museum. Can you imagine Khalid getting death threats because you got 200 artifacts on a table in a cafeteria where you educating people? You getting death threats? Wow. I consider him an icon in finding a voice for the voiceless and for justice through education and through upliftment, again, by us seeing our past and being able to link that with the alternatives of our future.